Hey guys, you're watching Volgora's Beer Reviews. And I got a wild one for you. This is Wild Red. I had no idea this stuff existed. Um, I made a re review a while back. I think it was you know, last winter, Christmas time. Um, that was Wild Blue. And it had a little dog on it. Um, and it was like blueberry, a blueberry beer. Uh, I don't really know what technically, if it's really a beer. It says lager. So that's what's really weird. It does not taste like a beer. And even my friend that does not like beer liked it. So I, th I was thinking it was just a malt beverage like Four Loco, Mike's Lemonade, or what's another example? Um, Sparks. Um, yeah, stuff like that. Beer Advocate Wild Red. Okay, it works. Beer Advocate gives it 61 out of 100. Uh, I don't know, you got lost it, yeah. Should be right here. Here, right there. No, no, I don't know if that don't fit. They're all the same size. I meant the the plug. This won't fit. The tire plug thing. Oh, there yeah, we go. Yeah, that will work. All right. Um, Beer Advocate gave it six two out of a hundred. Poor. Uh, the average review is two point five. Um, brewed by Anheuser Busch, which I was I didn't know about at first, but I, I knew it but from the last beer. Um, yeah, so without further wasting, um, let's try to see if I can do it with a bit first for cut my, so I don't, um, and see if I can do it without cutting myself. Oh, perfect. First try. Good vapor. Woo. Oh, that smells really good. If you love raspberries, I, I love raspberries, and this smells exactly like raspberries. Mmm. All right, here's the pour. This probably needs a little bit of pour down the center, and it does. It looks it looks like a sweet, sugary, candy-fied, you know, something like you get through Burger King drive-through or McDonald's drive-through, like a like a, sl a slushy or or a, a, li a strawberry limeade type, strawberry lemonade type thing. It looks just like that, or raspberry limeade. Dear. Anyway, smell. Yeah, like I said. Uh, sweet raspberry does not smell like beer whatsoever. All right, here we go for the sip. Oh, it's a little, it's a little sour. And this stuff is kind of expensive. This was actually only a dollar and a quarter or a dollar seventy-five. I don't remember which one it was, but it was a little more than a dollar. But I found it at a gas station. And they barely, they don't really have that much, but on the shelf, like just warm beers, just single stuff. Um, they had two of these, and I only needed one, you know. It's 8%. I don't typically need a lot of uh, high volume beers, like maybe one, and then, I don't know. I don't drink a bunch of them. Oh, shit on my lip. There. That's great, doing a video, and you find out you have shit on your lip. Anyways, it, it doesn't really have lacing. It kind of reminds me of, you know, the. Uh, but uh, but Bud Light uh, Margarita like the lime and there's a strawberry raspberry mango ra uh, yeah I haven't had the raspberry one to compare it with that'd be a good comparison but I probably won't find one of these anytime soon um, or or I'm not gonna buy a six pack of it anyways I would one is I only want one actually last time I tried the the, the blue I had two I think I did I don't remember. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I had one. I don't remember. But that, it seemed to taste a little better. It didn't have any weird anything going about it. It just tasted like uh, pancake syrup, just not, but not thick. You know, the blueberry taste was like exactly like pancake syrup. Yeah, this is kind of a little tart for me. Um, let me give this like a a six point seven. 
it's it's not really bad. Um, if you don't like beer and you, but you want to to drink something that's got be, uh, alcohol in it um, and still not look like a bum or you know frat boy with four loco or sparks or Mike's hard lemonade, you know I I honestly think this is a, a bump above that. But the raspberry is just kind of sour and. I don't know, a little too rough. If I had too much of this to drink it too fast, it would probably give me a really bad stomach ache. Like with uh, Mike's harder margarita. Yeah, I just I drank that and I'm like, Ugh! and I just had to I just had to lay down for a while. Um, and then if you leave something like this out, the ants just a, just are on it. Unless you don't have ants, then la di da. But you know, around in the sticks where I live, you know, we have bugs all over the place. You can't. You can't just, I don't know, put down a spray on the outside and expect it to stop everything. But uh, yeah, if you leave a beer, at least for me, if I if I leave a, a beer bottle out, on the session, no ants in it. Leave something like this out, even though it says lager. It says premium lager brewed with spices and with natural flavors. <laughs> Steven, my brother told me that anything that says natural flavors is uh, like beaver rectum or sack or whatever the hell that meant. Yeah, really delicious. And color from juice added. So, very interesting. Um, it's okay. Uh, I wouldn't buy it again, but if you're curiosity, you know, and especially if you like this type of stuff, it isn't like, it doesn't taste like beer, it tastes like fruit. Uh, go for this. Now, if you like beer and also like fruit, I'd, I'd advise uh, Pyramid, uh, Apricot, or Strawberry. Um, there's other ma brands and make whatever makers that make something similar to that where it ta still tastes like beer and the flavor doesn't overwhelm it. I'm not even sure this even really is a beer. I'm not really. I should have done more research on that. Um, really quick, I'll see if somebody did a review on it. While taking some first sip of this beer, it tastes raspberry juice. I think. Oh man, 8%. It's pretty delis delicious, but the aftertaste is like someone. Bit, or spilled their lager into your cup of juice. Drinking more than one of these at a time made me sick because of how sweet it was. I agree. Can't safely say that this is not my type of lager or that I even consider that it is lager. It's worth a try, though some people enjoy the overly sweet taste. A lot of people do, like uh, the guys on um, Reckless Eating. They, they all drink Four Locos and uh, what's the other one? A Colt 45 Blast and you know, shit like that. I'm sitting here like, gross. Dr drink some real beer. I mean, I don't want to say like, oh, uh, Bush or Pabst isn't real beer, but that's that's beer. That's not a malt beverage. You know, it's 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 a fact. Look it up. Um, yeah. So I don't know if it's really a beer. Taste super sweet tasting beer. Because it's sugary. Yeah, I don't know. So that's my wrap up. 